Right, Thursday the 9th of June, Obama meets with Bernie Sanders at the White House in the morning. Okay, discusses with Bernie Sanders. Um, You're out of the race, buddy. Bernie Sanders says, yeah, well, I want to go after that Trump guy. He's a bastard. I'm gonna, we're going to get him. I'll join up with you two socialist pigs, talking of Obama and uh, Hillary Clinton. And uh, they join forces together as a threesome to um, come against Trump. Now, Trump's part of this whole charade himself, okay? He's just an actor playing his part, like Biff in the uh, Back to the Future movies. Trump, Biff, same thing, same deal, depicted in the Hollywood film Back to the Future, Michael J. Fox. Okay, so they go after those three socialist commies, go, get together, and they go after Trump, who is presented as a capitalist, right? Not communist, although he is a commie himself. He's, he's part of the problem, he's not part of the solution, he's playing his role. Okay, now the three of them are going to go together against Trump. And uh, what else happened on Thursday? Oh, yeah, Obama welcomes the LGBT community to the White House once again for the opening of Gay Pride Faggot Month, Sodomite Month, uh, Do Whatever You Like Perversion Month. And it's, yeah, condoned by God now. Oh, didn't you know? That's according to Obama. God uh, is happy for sodomites to carry on and be legalized as well. (laughs) I'm talking like this in such sarcasm because I'm making up for the lack of church people and church pastors and ministers, especially in this country, Australia, even saying anything about this. They say nothing. They are scared shitless. They are scared shaking in their boots. They will not say anything. For the fear of losing congregation, for starters, and the money will stop come rolling in to those church coffers. What a time of deception to be living in. Okay, this all happened on Thursday, all 21 weeks and six days out from election day. 216 strikes again. Movie Pie, if you haven't seen it, you really ought to, because you're doing yourself a disservice. I know it's a pretty gruesome movie. It's... Uh, you know, horrific in some places, just the scenes uh, with Max and his hallucinations. But anyway, it has a very vital message. And if you see my breakdowns in my videos regards to Pi, that movie is the movie of the century, in my mind, for understanding these last days that we're in. All right, guys, gals, thanks for listening. And if you've got a thinking mind and you think that this information is important, I'll just say, if you've got a brain, share this video. Thanks for listening.